So here we are in the studio with the jury of the 69th Cannes Film Festival. What a wonderful jury. What a fabulous jury with their president, George Miller. Hello, Mr. President. We're delighted to welcome you here once again to Cannes. This time you are president of the jury. You have a fabulous team with you, Vanessa Paradi. Welcome to you. Uh, welcome to Cannes. Um, to pick up the mics if you if you want to uh, to say anything. Kirsten Dunst, thank you very much for being with us here in Cannes also. We're delighted to have you here once again. Valeria Galino, welcome to you as well. I'm really thrilled to have you here in the studio. Uh, Katayun Shahab. Thank you for being here. Arnold Lisplichat, hello, how are you? Well done for being in the jury this year. I think it's the first time for you in the feature film jury. It's great to see you. Laszlo Nimesh, you're back again. Last year, of course, you won the Grand Prix for your film, so welcome to the jury. Mads Mikkelsen is also with us. Thank you for being with us, Mads. And, of course, we have a legend of world cinema with us today. Donald Sutherland, welcome to you. Uh, it's great to have you here in Canada. Man. Donald, welcome. So, yes, George, you've got a wonderful jury. Have you met everyone now? You, how are things going so far? You, uh, have you laid down some rules? Please use the mic. They're, uh, they're a very lively bunch. We Hi. met last night, uh, and they have, um, there's a lot of humour, uh, re really uh, Subversive humour. Oh, yeah. Everyone's very passionate about films mm -hmm. and bring a lot. They have a lot, a long history. Uh, uh, many of them. Everyone has a history with Cat, mm -hmm. and and uh, so it's, I'm really looking forward. It's going to get very uh, wild. It's going to be really good. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, I think you like it when things get wild, George. I think uh, last year you brought us quite a wild film. It wasn't in competition, it was The Fury Road, Mad Max, and afterwards it went on to have a wonderful career. It could have won the Golden Palm here. It could have been in competition. For you, what, how would you define a good Palme d'Or? So, Mr. President, first of all. Um, for me, uh, it's very difficult. How do you measure right. a good film? But for me, it's a film that stays with you long after you've left the cinema. Mm. Somehow it washes over you and you remember it and you go refer back to it. It, it's, it's, um, it gives you an in some sort of very immersive experience for me. But that could mean in many, many films, many different genres, many mm. different styles. So who knows? It's, for us, it's going to be interesting because uh, we're just nine people. Mm. There's a whole bunch of... Um, critics and journalists and mm. public out there uh, watching the movies and uh, everyone will have an opinion and we have to be, I guess, a little bit like a nine-headed beast thinking about... Uh, <laughs> and who knows how it's going to go. But uh, for, for me, it's a film that um, just has a lot of power and affects me. Listening to you, George, uh, I think you're going to be a democratic president. I think you're going to let everyone speak out. Well, I'd be a fool if I didn't. Um, <laughs> they, they, uh, that's the point. Well, there are two reasons to be here. Um, one is to see great films mm -hmm. curated by the festival, films that no one's ever seen before, some which are barely finished, and the other is to be with people... Right. who are very, very passionate about film. It's mm. like going to film school. Mm. I'm just really interested to see what everyone's responses are going to be. I think that's one of the great values of being here. Mm. So um, you, uh, there's no other way to be uh, democratic. Have there been non-democratic uh, presidents of jury? I don't know. Je ne dirai rien. Oh, my lips are sealed. <laughs> Uh, let's continue to find out how people imagine the Palme d'Or is going to be. Before you see the films, uh, what kind of uh, mood are you in? What will a good uh, winner be? What are you expecting? Kirsten Dunst, what are you hoping to get out of the festival? I mean, I'm just excited to see what films are in competition and, you know, whatever moves me or speaks to me is, you know, I'll make my little list, take my notes. I plan on doing that since there's so many films that we all have to watch. But, you know, that'll be up to all of us together. So. Yes, it's a decision which you're all going to be taking together, but you must have your own point of view. What is a good Palme d'Or? Is it emotion? With the mic. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> I mean, I don't know. I don't. I'm not. I'm not really biased to anything. So mm. whatever I guess m- moves me and is you know everything comes together. The acting, mm. the screenplay, the way you know it's shot, and it's just you know whatever mm. accomplishes the most. I guess. Vanessa Paradis. Vous Vanessa Paradis, are you ready uh, for your uh, job here as a member of the jury? What would a good Palme d'Or be? Well, it's exactly what my colleagues have said. It's the film which is going to impact me the most when I see it. It's a film which I'll think about later. It's going to be a film which uh, creates the strongest effect in, in my mind. La, 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 l'émotion la plus forte I think the strongest avoir. emotion. The best film will create the strongest emotion. Valeria, Golino, vous avez Valeria vous êtes actrice, vous êtes you're an actress, aussi, you're a euh, filmmaker too. Est-ce que vous allez être à la mise en scène Are you going to be looking à, at uh, the direction de or de a specific uh, uh, way of acting? Bien sûr, je vais être, uh, je vais être très In à la fact, I'm going to be looking at the work of the director bien because bien films are all about the director's work. We're going to looking, I'm going to look at uh, the content also. The content is really important. But the form of uh, film is what makes the difference between uh, uh, that and any other media today. So the form is very, very important. And how about to you, Katayun Shahabi? Is it the form or the content, political perhaps? No, no. The form is, of course, uh, important. As my colleagues have all already said, it's the film which really grips you. The, fa- the Palme d'Or is a film uh, which uh, leaves a great uh, uh, feeling and it's a, it's a flavor that you want to keep with you for a long, long time. Arnaud Desplechins, form, content, what's important to you? Well, the form is, of course, what makes a film unique. You can read newspapers, magazines, you can watch documentaries. So the difference with cinema is uh, the the direction. Uh, Last year, there was Mad Max, uh, Fury Road, there was The Son of Saul, and that kind of film shows that the movies have a future. I want the Palme d'Or to be a completed work and also to indicate a future for the movie world. Yes, Son of Saul is with us, and Mad Max is also with us in the jury. Let's have a word with uh, Laszlo. What would be a Palme d'Or film for you? You received uh, a great prize here last year. Well, it's fabulous for me to be here. It's, It's magical to be part of the jury also. For me, uh, I want something to surprise me, uh, something which makes me learn something surprising about myself, something which I'm not expecting, something which will uh, come out of the blue and and stay with me long afterwards. Mads Mikkelsen, you've acted in many, many films which have marked many viewers. You won the Best Actor Prize here in Cannes one year. Are you going to be watching how the actors and actresses perform? We've been talking about the director here, but can the actor bring enough to the film to make it win the Palme d'Or? Well, uh, no. I think that, uh, like many other things in the film, uh, like the music, uh, like the acting, you have to forget it. Once you start forgetting it, that means the the film is working and and it will drag you in there. But when you start noticing the acting or you noticing the pointed feet at a ballet dancer, there's something wrong. Mm -hmm. So hopefully, when we forget ourselves and, and, and come out there with a shock or love inside, whatever we come out with, the film has worked, and that's what we're all looking for. Well said. Thank you. A final word from, uh, well, from Donald Sutherland. Some 60 years ago, in Toronto, one afternoon, I saw two films. I saw La Strada by Fellini. And immediately after that, 15 minutes after that, I saw Prats of Glory by Kubrick. And that afternoon changed my life. So what I'm looking for here in the films, in the 21 films we're going to see, is a film that will change my life. 
And I hope you see such a film. What a wonderful way of uh, concluding our interview. I've got shivers down my spine. Uh, well done, everybody. Thank you for being with us. I hope you enjoy the work ahead of you. This is your last interview before the pr well, there's a press conference, and then you have to be uh, very silent about what you're, you're saying. Thank you, Arnaud, Kirsten, Valeria, Mads, Laszlo, Vanessa, Katayun, and Donald, and George, of course. Thank you very much. Enjoy the festival. Thank you.